All right, I just got to the airport. Um, I don't have too long. I probably got an hour and a half before sunset, so I got plenty of time. I want to let this wind die down a little bit anyway, but there's enough wind now to kite, which is perfect. Um, and today I'm going to be flying my new wing. I bought an 18 meter uh, Z blade. So it's made by Sky Paragliders. Uh, as far as I know, there's only three people in the U.S. that own one, and I'm one of them. So um, that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, I don't know. It's supposed to be fast. So you saw the last video, the Hadron XX. Um, that I fly the 18 meter. I got that up to uh, about 47 miles an hour top speed. Uh, I'm not really looking for top speed out of this wing. I just want good flying characteristics, really. Um, but I don't know what to expect. So everyone says it's fast. Um, it's an 18 meter. The Hadron's an 18 meter. Um, loaded about the same percentage wise on each one. Um, so I don't know. I'm expecting it not to be as fast as the Hadron actually because the aspect ratio is a little different and the uh, cells in the wing are a little bit thicker. So, But we'll see, we're gonna get up there, I'm gonna kite it for a minute, and uh, yeah, we'll fly. Peace. So, got here early, and then uh, some guys came out and started talking to me, and uh, they got a hangar back here, right there, and um, one guy's got a Challenger 2 in there, and the other guy, I don't even know what plane it is, some experimental. Uh, plane looks fast, so we got to talking about airplanes, and I just killed a half an hour, so uh, I don't know how much of a review I'm going to be able to do on this wing, but uh, I'm at least going to get up there and test it out, so see how it goes. So real quick. Even the bag, the quality of this bag is amazing. I don't know how good it's shown it, but separate bag for your risers in, built into the bag. Um, the bag itself has a compartment here for storing things. Um, has backpack style straps on the back. Um, I mean, even like the ends, look at this. Even the ends of the straps are like sewn, like a little stitch here. Good qual. I mean, this is like, I don't know. I really like that bag. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> and that's the wing. So the footprint is much smaller, but I expected that because it's like a clipped wing style. Um, I don't know if you've seen these before, but see how like the end of the wing? That's that's it right there. Instead of coming out to here. Um, so we'll see what that does in flight. All right, I'm going to get ready. It's a new day, as you can tell by my lack of shirt and new hat. Yeah, so I was going through the footage of the first initial thoughts video I just did, and uh, I didn't really like a lot of the things I said. It didn't make much sense. The audio was kind of garbage anyway, and I recorded the first half of it with no audio because I forgot to turn the GoPro Cena switch on, which is coming to an end anyways because I bought uh, a new GoPro. I bought the Hero 7, so I'll be doing some soldering and all that stuff to get the audio working on that. Um, but the crappy audio and the GoPro 4 footage is coming to an end. But yeah, I'm just going to go up and give you some of my initial thoughts. This will be my second flight in the wing. The first one was about 40 minutes. Yeah, I'm going to kite a little bit and uh, we'll go from there. Peace.
hear that? Which sucks because that wind came right up. That'd have been it. So the in-flight audio for this flight, for some reason, was garbage. Uh, it's basically unusable. So I'll just tell you my initial thoughts overlaid on some of this awesome chase cam footage from the other night. So the first thing about this wing is its launch characteristics. Um, it's an extremely easy wing to launch. Uh, I've put a lot of hours kiting into it already and uh, really gotten comfortable um, getting the wing up reverse and forward, and it's a breeze. You can even launch this wing without uh, pulling on the A's. So that was something that I cannot do on my 18 meter Hadron. That required uh, a much, I don't know, tighter launch technique, I'll say. But this this is a breeze. It's amazing. I love it. Um, it's so much fun to launch. Um, next, it's a quick wing. So I'd say it's about two or three miles an hour slower than the Hadron is, um, but still plenty fast enough. I uh, got it up on speed bar and I, like I said, it was probably only a couple miles an hour slower than the Hadron. But again, that's not what I was looking for in this wing. I, you know, I have my 18 meter Hadron still, so that's my quick wing. Uh, I was looking for um, something a little bit different out of this. Uh, next, it's a, it's a fun wing to fly. So you can see in this footage here, I'm ripping down low in this, um, uh, in this quarry. I have all the confidence in the world in the wing. It's just, it, it feels awesome. Uh, it's very controllable, it's quick, it's very responsive, uh, and uh, it, it's just a blast down low. Uh, next, it's, I haven't uh, done any collapses on it, but I did um, try to do some frontal collapses while I was kiting uh, in some laminar air, and I was shocked at how hard I could jerk on the A's and the wing would pop back up and not collapse. My Hadron, if you gave it a good solid jerk on the A's, the wing would fold up under and you'd have to kind of back up and pull the wing and get it to pop back up. With this wing, even with a really hard jerk on the A's, it was really hard to get uh, a frontal collapse out of it while kiting. Uh, and I, probably a lot of that is to do with the size of the um, of the cell openings in the front of the wing. Uh, and then finally, um, it it's compared to the Hadron, I think it's more tame, uh, which I'm happy about because I didn't want the same wing. Uh, I didn't want two really hot, spicy wings. I wanted something a little more tame for days that I didn't feel like uh, I needed all that speed and energy that the Hadron carries. So yeah, I mean, I've only got probably five flights on this wing, maybe five, six hours of flight time, but uh, I'm really enjoying it so far. I have zero complaints about it so far. Uh, and yeah, I'll probably give you guys another update as I continue to fly and put some more hours on it. But uh, yeah, so far this wing is awesome. I'm in love with it So. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry it was kind of cut together like this. And uh, I'll leave you with some more chase cam footage. And hopefully the next video will be a little more uh, smooth than this one. But thanks for watching. Peace.